Hey everybody, welcome to the Mark Parham Podcast. Um, you know, I want to talk about, uh, I think it was, what's her name, Meg Thee Stallion, and uh, how Meg Thee Stallion was at a Kamala Harris event, and it was really sad because, you know, some of these Democrats, even though they claim they understand black voters and black people, it's so sad how they still, you know, think, well, you know what, if I put a few rappers up on stage, then I'll have the black vote. And, um, you know, for some people that might be the case, but I was really liking what I saw online where people in the comment section were saying, no, this is not a way to gain our vote. I don't support this. This is degenerate behavior. Like a lot of people were calling this stuff out and I'm so happy because people are waking up, it's black people especially, are waking up to some of this, uh, you know, this, this Democrat agenda that they push where they think, you know, we're so simple minded that will automatically support you if you have a rapper on stage or two rappers come up on stage. And I think with the Meg, St the Meg Thee Stallion uh, situation, I mean, there were some folks in the audience who were Democrat voters who were looking like, this is sort of weird and out of place. I mean, I was looking at <clears throat> some of the white people in the audience and they didn't know where, it's almost like they were lost. And so it's just so sad how some of the folks in the Democrat Party think about black people. They think that, you know, if you can bring some up on, somebody up on stage that's going to rap and twerk in front of us, or, you know, you go to a chicken dinner or something, that we're going to vote for you. And I, it's so sad because these Democrats always talk about Republicans being racist and Republicans don't understand minorities. And they keep on promoting these just stereotypical, I mean, they just keep on promoting these just stereotypes about black people. I mean, even uh, remember Biden, how he was sitting down and I think he was eating chicken or something like that, or the family was eating chicken around a kitchen table. And, you know, it's just, or they had that one uh, video where they were trying to get strippers to convince black uh, men to vote. And it's, it's just, black folks are more sophisticated than that. And, uh, you know, it's amazing that a party that claims they understand black people so much, and they say black people are the base of the Democrat party, but they just keep on, you know, promoting these stereotypes. And so I think it was a horrible idea to get uh, Meg Thee Stallion or whatever her name is out there and to rap. And also they got Quavo and, you know, his situations and some of the things he's been going through in his life. And, uh, you know, just to see the Democrats put those two at, a, uh, at an event for Kamala Harris or plan that, or I don't know if she was behind that, but just to see that whole, just to see the videos, you know, come out where they have, you know, Quavo speaking and Meg Thee Stallion up on stage. It just, it's, it's almost like a minstrel show. You know how you had minstrel shows back in the days where people would wear blackface and just dance around and act stupid. It almost reminded me of that. Like when you see them old uh, clips from old movies and stuff like that. And so I think the Democrats, they're, they're tone deaf. I mean, even though people always say, oh, the Republicans they're uh, racist and all this other stuff, but some of these Democrats need to look in the mirror. And the sad part about it, you have black Democrats that go up online and say, oh, this was an amazing idea. And, you know, tell lies to other black people to think that it was OK to have, you know, a, a, an event like that. I mean, you can have an event like that, but it's not a good way to gain black voters, at least in my opinion. But it's, it's so sad to see other black people make excuses for Kamala Harris. And this it's it's very sad. It almost reminds me of what happened with Joe Biden when people were like, oh, Joe Biden just had a bad day or he had a cold and he's going to come back and everybody has a bad night. And it's just like sometimes you just got to just, you know, keep it real and admit the truth. And the truth of the matter is that that Kamala Harris campaign event was a disaster. Yeah, I mean, it was a horrible idea. It doesn't represent all black people. It doesn't represent the black community. And we're not going to vote for you just because you can say a few rap lyrics and twerk on stage. Like, I think black people are... A lot smarter than that and so again in the comment section let me know what you think about the whole um you know meg the stallion and kamala harris collaboration i think it was a horrible event horrible idea and uh you know it was just shows how tone deaf some of the uh folks in the democrat party are so let me know how you feel about uh that event in the comment section thank you